So yes, finally, finally, finally. So of course I'm back on there really quick. Really, really quick. Really, really quick. What? 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 Poggers? Pokemon Journey Review. So of course, um, for a Pokemon video I did it all. So yeah, of course, new news, new stuff of um, journeys, review and stuff like that, of course. Get some hair up a little bit. You already know the ghost and everything, of course, though. Um, we're gonna go for the last episode left off, pretty much. We got Ash vs. Steven. Not a bad episode. It's gonna do pretty much a lot of it, though, but it was still pretty good, though, and stuff like that. Of course, I should put my towel because I'm sweating already. Ooh. But yeah, you'll probably burn through this episode really, really quick just because I got a lot of stuff to do today. I want to just hurry up and stuff that, that, like that, though. I got a lot of videos to do today. So, of course, let's go ahead and get started, though, of course. But yeah, I hope you enjoy your day and stuff like that. Of course, I can't physically talk with you guys because. Recording, screen, a little bit. But yeah, of course, let's go ahead and get started though, of course. But yeah, again, episode starts off really simple and easy. It's introducing Ash, Steven, t rock is being excited, everyone's being excited. We got Iris back from regular clothing. You could pretty much stay the whole way through to Ash, you know, with stuff like that though, of course. But yeah, pretty good, pretty simple stuff right there. So yeah, again, Iris is just, just thank as and over over um, Hulu and everything, of course. But yeah, like I said, I'm a very, very simple opening, because of, that, of course, of course, I was freaking out and stuff like that, of course. Ash, Steven, pretty much being ready for the battle and everything, everybody introducing themselves pretty much so. Ash having called, of course, Mega Evolution, Dan Max, and of course, Z. Again, they pretty much don't even know what they do, it's unpredictable and everything. So, it's really good though, of course. You would see him come in his, um, Gigantamax. It'd be cool to saw, like, Gigantamax, you know, Mega Steelix. Steelix. <laughs> Better gross, but it, it, whatever, it's whatever, though. But of course, though, um, get in the battle room, which begins stuff like that, of course, Pokemon, Pokemon, Dragonfish versus Mega Shiny. Like I said, it's Mega Shiny, but of course, I don't care. It's, it's gonna happen. We know it's gonna happen. Of course, the first round, everybody's just, you know, it's super excited, super ready to go. Ash Cool goes full on throttle, no holding back, holding, um, battling against, um, Better Ghost, just first, like, chomps in, of course, deeper blocks and stuff like that. Of course, makes sense. Of course, Ash is getting ready for the battle and everything, of course. And, of course, um, think of the Paul and, um, his brother, of course, Reggie. Again, everybody's thinking of the strategy, pretty much, he just gets Better Ghost here, which was kind of pretty much of a good teaser, just kind of, you know, being like, okay, Ash is gonna fight Steven in the Paul episode, and, you know, kind of just like his good use Gengar pretty much just to take advantage of that though. Or, you know, he probably didn't use it because of what happened though. Because I feel like using Gengar's people to help, but again, a pretty cursor to this episode. A prologue kind of though. Yeah, the of course, Stephen calls back that and calls out freaking Agron, which we already saw in the teaser anyway. I think I just could call Pikachu next, I think, after this. So, of course, everybody's watching this stuff like that, of course. Oh, we even get more Owen people. We get, um, Drew. We get, um, what was his name? I forgot. I give it to getting cameras everybody in here. But by the way, Rip Silas, I forgot I mentioned Iris' this episode with Silas today. Silas. Silas didn't even show up though, so yeah, Rip Silas, I kind of forgot about him. Um, was it? I forgot, how did I forget his name? Was it? How did I forget his name? I know it's Drew, I know it's. Oh, Professor, oh, Professor Birch, that's cool. Um, dang, I forgot his name already. Don't watch the end of the episode, I'm gonna kind of know. But yeah, of course, everybody's just basically cheering on, like, you know, he's fighting for Hoenn. You know, actually fighting for everybody, you know, not just rivals, everybody pretty much is now his journey pretty much. Even like just again, we flash between everybody, which is cool. Dude, we got Tracy back here. Hey, let's go. Um, yeah, then of course Agron and um, Dragonfish right start battling back and forth. Dragonfish gets pulled back and of course gets KO'd deadly though. So it's poor Ash like starting out though. And of course New Rock is just cheering them on and stuff like that, of course. Ash coming about uh next Pokemon Gengar using this new move Will West, I believe. Yeah, of course, I should take advantage of that and stuff like that. Of course, all those Pokemon are just super excited. <laughs> Try to just play throw with the TV and stuff like that, of course. Gengar gets pushed back, super excited. Oh, um, Magon's getting ready and excited as well. Um, what else? Hey, it does use Stone Edge. Look like it just used Stone Edge, but, um, of course... Um... Um, actually, everyone actually gets burned and gets one shot, pretty much. So, yeah, Gengar, um, everybody's off to pretty much start again. The Mentor's pretty much, you know, oh, <laughs> that's a good thought. I might have to put that in the, I might have to put that in the thumbnail. Actually, that's really good. So, yeah, um, basically all the courts in front of the Charizard, basically being gods to Gengar. Makes sense to double that, of course. Yeah, then, of course, Stephen calls out to Pokemon. I forgot his name. I know, I just saw the name of it, though. But I know it was like a plant, fossil Pokemon from Hoenn, though, so, yeah. Again, not a bad one, though. I think it's sure to choose Solar Beam while, um, you know, um, Gengar gets caught up in the wind, attacks and everything, just going back and forth and everything, of course. Um, of course, Iris, um, hop in, of course, um, everybody's being worried pretty much, of course, the one, you're being worried as well. But yeah, again, just, you know, just going back and stuff like that, of course, just finding that weak point and stuff like that, of course. Then, it charges up too much, way too much, then, of course, um, Gengar actually, I think it's Leech's and then he holds it back, and I think he's solar being blast through and everything. Then, of course, um, I think Gengar might get one shot here. Let me see. Um, Gengar get one shot? Oh no, actually survives though, so yeah, survives choosing them. Of course, then it just perturbed you Shadow Ball. Then it gets just getting just utterly whipped though, so. Sorry about Gengar. Then, of course, Pikachu, I think this is Ash's last Pokemon though, but you already know Pikachu is gonna fight hard and stuff like that, of course. Um, of course, Ghost Warrior, Ice is cheering him on. 
um, Team Rock Shooting wants to, of course, Steven, and of course, um, Ash go full one out, just going back and forth, blowing blow for moves, using speed to their advantage, using power to their advantage, just going back and forth and stuff like that, of course, though. But of course, everybody's super excited seeing Ash battle and everything, of course, they're just going, commenting their own thoughts and everything. Then, of course, you know, Pokemon gets one shot, so of course, Steven and Ash both, both have one Pokemon left. Ash is super excited, Steven and Ash again, the battle's really good, though, of course. Then, of course, Team Rock gets trying to go on again. Then, of course, Steven pulls out his final Pokemon. Uh, shiny Metagross, woohoo, yeah, you already know it's gonna make up off, so there's no point in this. Um, but yeah. Yeah, just probably just make up off and stuff like that, of course. Then, of course, Adam, Ash is super excited, though, even though, like, he just pull out, just uses Thunderbolt and everything. And, of course, Metagross with... Ice Maker. Um, but yeah, then Metagross is just full on, just speed and everything. Big just Thunderbolt just completely misses and stuff like that. Of course, the Metagross just goes in full power. You know, the A that's commenting on it, though, and stuff like that, of course, again, her having a Mega Ball Pokemon. It's stuff like that, of course. Steven have pretty much kind of the same thing. Um, yeah, you can say Steven's a distant account, Diantha. We already know that. That's not confirmed. I don't know. It's video. Okay, my video is good. I'll make sure my face game is still good. Yeah, of course, Pikachu actually gets bow damage. She actually looks really, really good and really, really detailed and everything. Then, of course, um, everybody just pretty much like, as she looks in the corner, what's going to do and stuff like that. Then, of course, Pikachu Iron Tails gets his um, bearings back up. Then, Pikachu, oh, unfortunately, gets slammed down to hit hard. But yeah, then of course, everybody's just worrying what Ash might do and stuff like that, of course, will he lose? Then of course, Ash full and close on his E move, because I thought he, I didn't know he was going to do that though in this, but they teased it pretty much already, then and stuff like that, of course. Of course, Ash and Pikachu both leave each other using their 10 billion freaking billion Thunderbolts, while that girl starts to fight back, and then it just, you know, gets obliterated though, and Ash wins. So that was a really good match though. After Cynthia, this going to be a good match next though, but yeah, it was really good though. Everybody celebrates, everybody's happy, of course. Again, Ash and Cynthia, that was a promise already going to be a battle. Yeah, of course, everybody's still being happy and stuff like that, Ash won and everything, so, yeah, pretty good stuff. Yeah, Steven congratulates Ash and stuff like that, of course, Ash vs. Cynthia is going to be the next battle. Day that was Leon, again, we're pretty much already hitting the semifinals. Pretty simple and easy story, though, today. Then, of course, everybody's congratulating Ash, cheering him on and stuff like that, of course. Then, um, what else down here? Okay, yeah, then Leon pretty much looked on the horizon, um, but if I did that, of course, an episode ends off there with some really good, just again, good animation, good coloring on this episode, though, overall. But yeah, um... Honestly, though, I'm just going to full thoughts because I'm already at, what, seven minutes right now? So, um, not a bad episode, though. Overall, I think it was really, really good. It was really good and animated well. Done well. Steven versus Ash again. I don't really have that main connection with Steven, in my opinion, though. I'm sorry to say that because I didn't grow up with them that much. I really grew up with Cynthia. Older, here and there, you're like, older was okay. Um, what else? Oh, good. We got some more cameos and stuff like that. Of course, all the Johto kids. Um, Kito kids. Everybody. Really good. Again, the callback to Paul, like when he fought, uh, Ash and Paul um, fought again, that was really well done because of just that reference, you know, Ash was going to use Metal Girls against Steven because he realized, even him and Paul originally, all realized pretty much, you know, that's not going to work because they pretty much tried to do that with Ash and Paul's fight, so I kind of get why, like a precursor. Really, I think we already knew, like Ash was going to fight Steven anyway, so whatever. Um, but yeah, um, not a bad episode. Animation really well, coloring was really done well. Again, not, shock not shocking because of the leak, you know, stuff like Again, it's really, it's just, it's just got Pokemon leak. They don't hold back, they don't go back. It's all really good, all really well done. But yeah, not a bad though episode. And I want to review it really quick just because I got a lot of stuff to do today. I'm going to try to burn out all this as fast as I can. So sorry about all me or skimming over the episode, going over the episode. But I hope you guys like this format though, just me going super fast and at the end I can just kind of come up with thoughts and opinions and some of that though. But yeah, episode. Really good, I like it overall. Really good. It's alright, like I said, really super fast because it can it's so, so simple and so easy to go over. But yeah, I enjoyed them. So again, sorry I have to go pick to Steven just because he was brilliant even in that one in general. I think he just kind of honestly forgot about him. I know the game is all that, of course. And his beauty is. I don't mind it's honest. Even it's like concept and stuff like that, pretty cool. But then, like, you know, Kyle comes back. I think the end is just. I mean, I don't know. I think Diantha and probably. Maybe Cynthia, because those are two I really kind of grew up with, though, do kind of mean a lot to me. Leon's really just fun overall, though. Like, he just, like, the strongest one, he's going to win everything, pretty much. I mean, that's why he didn't probably lose that long. That's why Leon probably took the L and lost. But yeah, I mean, in the last episode of Iris and Cynthia was really good, too. Like, these episodes are really good. That one was a longer way to fight after years from the first fight. I mean, all the experience, everything that actually, like, actually did, like, really do some damage. Like, the Giga Impact and Dragon Rage, it did some solid disgusting damage. Battle damage Pikachu was actually pretty cool. I thought the stomach was looking brown. The scar saw that look really different. You can see Pikachu with the same battle damage. They probably already have like a model sheet or a prep sheet for that though, but that looked really good. The um of course I choose the Z move because again we didn't even know what he was gonna do. He could do the Z move, could do the Gigantamax, 
he's gonna do any of it. And he's just like, yeah, we're gonna do everything. Because some of my friends, actually, I was talking to, he was like, oh, why should actually do all of this? I mean, he's doing it, he's right here, he's doing it for it, though. So, um, yeah, though, so all that, of course. But yeah, good episode, I liked overall, though, so yeah. Um, probably getting into here, like, some area, the 10 minute mark, and, you know, guide that 10 minute stuff. So yeah, see you guys there, though, thanks for watching, have a great day, quite a lot of good, though. Be sure to stay safe, watch friends, God bless all of you, go help, I know where I'm at, so it's something we're ready to. Right, so if you can, go outside, touch some guys, some copy, and shout out to my friend on Discord, everywhere, social, so what you guys think about all the videos, of course, like to hit again. As it was great, I liked it overall, again, really fast, really good, we saw see all Ash Pokemon, colorful, bright, beautiful, Really good, 10 out of 10, Diantha versus Leon, that's going to be a good fight, and of course Cynthia versus Ash, that's been a long way to fight for years. Whew, Diantha versus Leon, that's going to be really cool though, that'll, that'll probably be, no, next episode I could give you a Chloe episode, I think it's just reviewing over all the Chloe stuff though, pretty much, so, I could probably skip it, if it doesn't happen, I'll, against Chloe episode, I have to review every Chloe episode, I love Chloe, so, yeah, see you guys later though again, though, peace out.